Yep, Deuteronomy 22. Mm -hmm. The question was, in Deuteronomy 22, 5, uh, does it say, in the woman should not wear anything? By the way, it doesn't say clothes for women, but it does say for uh, a man to put on a woman's garment. It's very interesting. The Hebrew is a little different. But is there a difference between childish activity and chosen, willful cross-dressing? Definitely. Definitely, there is. But what you do is, and I mean, I'm a parent. Did you know if you parent, children do all kinds of things they shouldn't do, and you take their little hand and say, don't do that. I mean, I can remember talking to people at church, and they're sticking their finger up my nose. I go, stop that. You're not supposed to do that. And they stick their finger in your ear and say, stop that. You're not supposed to do that. And they do all kinds of stuff, and you say, stop that. If we don't say, that isn't proper. Mm-hmm. You mean going around the house wearing mama's high heels in the long dress, and it's, it's funny for a moment, and then what you say to them is, that's cute. But you know what? We don't want to ever cross lines. Did you know, actually, children are a lot brighter than we think. And if we say, do you know what? There's a line you can cross here. It's just like, does every child that, that dresses up like some figure in Halloween, are they seeking and invoking the devil? No. But if you tell them, you know what? God is very opposed to witchcraft. And so, you know, you want to be, you want to, you want to be a Halloween character or whatever. We need to be very careful that we don't offend a holy God. I think we're too gracious and say, oh, it's funny. When, when we have a culture that is going crazy. I mean, this new guy that they just tracked down, the cannibal homosexual. Is anybody reading the paper about this? It is... It's just the beginning of what we're going to see in a society steeped in pornography. So what we should do is not get paranoid, and every time our child, you know, uh, comes walking down acting like they're, they're playing like mama or daddy or whatever, that we go ballistic. But what we say is, you know what, it's cute, it's fun, it's, it's okay for a moment, but the direction of our life is away from that because God is offended by that. So, so that's what I think we need to be very cautious to affirm the truth, but not to go overboard.